that your leg is what starts the spin. So a lot of times what happens is that people will get into position, their leg will be extended, and they kick straight back and try to kind of somehow levitate into the air. We're, we're using a spinning pole and we're always trying to make a circle. We're always trying to wrap ourselves like a ribbon. That's how this whole thing works. So when I take the leg out and around, that's what starts the spin. You can think of it like, I tell my students, like a big pizza, okay? There's a big pizza on the floor. You have your little tiny ring close to the pole where you walk, and then there's also a big pizza pie. And your leg, whenever you're doing spins, you want it to be on the crust. So when we're doing gallop, I want my leg to come all the way out, and that's what starts the spin. Okay, I want to be all the way on the crust. When I'm doing reverse grab, I want the leg to come all the way out. And that's what starts my spin. And that allows me to be safe with my upper body as well because I'm not jerking myself into it. All right, so let's go one more time. Right and left. In the beginning, you want to rest your back against the pole and stay nice and close and really pull down on the top arm. Wrap, I like to wrap that elbow on the bottom and stay pretty close in and let my leg do the work, okay? Let's try it both sides, walking from the pirouette. Here we go. One, two, three, cross, four, pirouette. And turn, step out, release. Step to the other side and one, two, three, cross, four, pirouette. Let the leg do the work. Release. Good. And come back to our original side and finish. Thank you for dancing with me today. I hope that you had fun and I will see you in the next video.